Browser, browser world. Is despite its complex na nature, upon close examination, the hair is really just another shape on the head. The trick, ah, there's a trick, right? To seeing the hair shape is to forget about the fact that it's made up of a thousand strands a hundred thousand strands and instead imagine it's clay or some sculptable material ah uh -huh. okay do you get that all right so we got to look at what is this hair doing in the front well it's one he said one big overall shape so what i would do here is I look at it like this, that if it's just one basic overall shape, I would do something like this. So it's just one big shape, right? So once we have it as one big shape, then what we can do is we can add contours to the hair. So like, cause he said to act like it was clay or something sculpted. So what I would do is I would do like this and then maybe something like that uh and then i and then i will add shapes up you know afterwards something like this here i think that looks interesting and then uh, on the outside if you want that's when i would add like little particulars but this is the this is what he's trying to to get us to see so i'm just going to do it real easy for you all right and now uh, that we understand that then it's become simple at that point we'll just kind of uh, use it this guy has a definitely a uh, I say uh, what's that flower pot maybe flower pot definitely a flower pot yeah so here you see how I started with the hair first and then Got a little long neck shape. Okay. So that's how you would draw the hair, right? It's real easy. All you gotta do is look at it as one shape. So we'll just try a couple more hairdos. That was an interesting hairdo, by the way. Um let me see. Something like this. Okay. And then it's one big shape so the side shape would be something like this and then the top shape would be something like this ah yeah that's right because now his ear will go like about like here Yeah. Okay. That works for me, right? <laughs> okay. And uh, let me see here. Um, okay. I got an idea. Um, in the front. Hmm. Okay, so that makes sense to me. Hmm. 
Hmm. That's funny. Hey, how are you today, Tammy? So this is the this is the deal with with this guys. I'm just you know today I, I'm doing some. Uh, you know how I do it. I always go. I like to practice like procedure. So I don't I don't need anything complicated here to be able to jar his face right. You see how you see how easy those shapes are right there. Those shapes are very easy to duplicate. You know you shouldn't have a problem at all being able to follow me with this. Um, let me see. Ah, uh, you know, the other day, yesterday, I was talking to. Uh, oh, I had a, I had a class. I had a meet and greet last night. Um, it, I gotta say, it went well. It went well. Okay, let me see. Uh, what am I thinking about? What am I thinking about? Like maybe like a, a um, almost like a folded piece of paper. You know, like if 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 everything if it, if his mouth, we don't want it to look flat, so we want it to look like, like almost like a folded piece of paper, like that. See how it doesn't look flat when you think of it like a folded piece of paper. That's what I was thinking about, like a flap. You know what I mean? Like if you're drawing a, if I'm like I'm drawing something like this right here. right and then the inside of it is kind of like this I can give you a better idea of if I do like this you see how I look like a, a like a like a wedge right there so that's kind of how I'm doing the, the lips right there and then uh, let me see I think this would be the front and this will be the back okay which is something also interesting right there as I'm drawing this I'm thinking these lines right here that this shape I wanted it to be uh, first and then these to be like secondary lines so I put this shape in front of those shapes kind of made their lines overlap the front of it um, I don't know if that would have went better if I would have went the other way but I thought that was pretty cool um, so these are secondary lines. So here I made the chin shape, the first line. Right. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Anywho, I think that was a real simple. Hey guys, I hope that you enjoyed that video tutorial. If you did, don't hesitate guys to go ahead and give us a like. Also guys, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and the notifications button. This way, when we put up new material, you'll be the first to know. If you have any questions about our markers or pens or paper, and you'd like to know where I get some of the materials that I use here on my art stream, there's a link in the description below so you can go ahead and check that out as well. And also guys, we'd like to welcome your questions and comments so that we can get some new ideas. You know, it's always good to have new fresh ideas for our next and upcoming videos. Oh, and don't forget to check out these two super cool videos right here. So guys, thanks again for your love and support of our channel. You guys be safe out there. And as always guys, I wish you happy cartooning.